Amanda Klutz is remembering her late love. The talk co-host took to Instagram to mark the two-year anniversary of her husband, Nick Cordero's untimely death. He passed away from COVID complications at age 41. Quote, two years ago today, Elvis and I said goodbye to Nick. It was the hardest day of my life. There hasn't been a day I haven't missed him. Nick was a presence. His smile and laugh lit up a room. He loved everyone and was a great friend to anyone that knew him. Amanda wrote alongside a montage of videos and photos of the couple with their now three-year-old son, Elvis. Amanda went on to share a story of a friend who had a, quote, beautiful dream about the late Broadway star on the first anniversary of his death that made the day a little bit easier to bear. Quote, we were all at a party and Nick was there looking happy and radiant. When she asked him why he was there, he said, what do you mean? Today is my birthday. It's the one day I get to come back and celebrate with everyone I love. Hearing this completely changed my mood. Amanda shared. The mother of one ended her beautiful tribute by writing, quote, I love you, honey. I miss you more than life. Amanda has kept the father of her son's memory alive in a number of ways, including dancing to the couple's wedding song during her time on Dancing with the Stars this past season. At the time, Amanda told Access Hollywood that performing to the song brought her a lot of joy. Our wedding dance was a highlight you know, of our wedding day. And our wedding day will go down in history as one of the best days of my life. So, you know, this was more of like a celebration, a joyous moment for me to be able to dance to this song again. But in this way was so special because, you know, our wedding dance was full of like, you know, silly antics that please your guests and crowd. And Nick isn't a dancer. So it was just kind of like fun. But this was, this was a moment for me to feel like I was Ginger Rogers and Alan was also Ginger Rogers. I, I took his joke from him. Um, no, it's not funny. <laughs> no, but you know what I mean? Like, I felt like tonight I was in like an old Hollywood musical and, um, and Alan did such an amazing job choreographing a dance that kind of felt more Broadway. So I, I was able to kind of go back in time and take that into consideration too. It was really kind of just a, a beautiful, joyous moment for me tonight. Absolutely. Um, I mean, to, uh, I'm curious for you, you know, obviously you've, you've said to us before that, you know, you feel Nick constantly in your spirit. I'm curious, what do you think he would say about tonight's performance? And you mentioned that your, you know, wedding dance, did you kind of pay homage or incorporate any moves from, from the original into this one? Yeah, I think what he would say is, oh, that's how it's done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Um, yes, and you know, Alan took a couple different little moves that we, you know, he watched our wedding dance video and, and we stole a little couple things from it to kind of pay homage to it. Um, but you know, it was really special to actually dance something that was completely different from our wedding dance. And, um, you know, the song obviously means so much. So then to be able to do choreography that was completely different, but also pay tribute to was so special. I thought it was a perfect marriage, if you will, of the two.